So here we are guys, just arrived at one Ada. And I'm really excited to see what is actually going to happen here. I want to try out two new things. One, as I say, is this new console that is on the carrier to see if it's working all right. And to be able to get back into an anarchy system. And my favorite anarchy system is Eurovia. And then try and find out exactly what the ins and outs are with this new mission. Landed, but uh, we've always got the auto computer to be able to use as a backup. You must forgive me, I've only been playing this game about four years. So, the first thing that I actually want to do is just be able to transfer over my one ship that is still left at the last area that I was. So, it was the dolphin that I had there. Transfer ship to this location. Confirm. See my anaconda is also there. And my further lance. My further lance, after running the last lot of missions for the paint jobs. I decided to get myself a Ferdy Lance and I haven't totally upgraded it yet but um, I'm really impressed with the paint job that I actually got. So let's get out of the ship. And disembark. Go and see how this new system is working. Gosh, they haven't done anything as far as the light is concerned. Inside the camera, that's for sure. I've never seen it this dark before. Not that bad that you've got to even turn the torch on. Good grief, look at that, you can't see anything. definitely say that the light hasn't improved. It's got really, really dark. Just like how dark this actually is. That's no good to Mana Beast.
So let me check up to make sure all these lots are doing what they're supposed to be doing. That one can't even sit in a chair properly. So let's get into it. Let's just sit down. Aha, interact. And we want to go to Barovia. So that was successful. Fifteen minutes before the jump, so that gives me plenty of time to be able to get my ships over here. But just look how dark it is inside of here. This is absolutely ridiculous. definitely step right down in that chair and he's doing the complete opposite it really seems that FDEB really take one step forward and ten steps backwards no the wonder everybody's up in arms about what's actually happening really sad. I wonder if we can interact with this. No, can't interact with that. Management. At least we can interact on here now as well. As I say, guys, I don't know what your opinion is, but to me, this just seems really dark. And don't we normally have a full screen up there? And a full countdown? Really this, it's really getting pitiful this game. And I love this game, don't get me wrong. I played Elite ever since the 80s when we used to load a cassette tape into our cassettes and download it onto my BBC 
and then play the stick version of this. And time's progressed so many years and we just seem to be going backwards instead of forwards. Anyway, enough moaning. One good thing that I managed to do when I was on these missions for the Golconda was to be able to stock up the carrier on tritium and did manage to sell some of the tritium and the prices were the best that I've ever seen as they did advertise. But for some reason or other, the prices just fell away again. Um, I don't know if it was just the circumstances that was inside the game or whatever, but one minute we'll be getting 413,656 credits for every ton. And then all of a sudden it just dropped down to 200 again, which was ridiculous. And as I say, the... Um, the prices that we were getting for doing the missions it's it's pointless staying inside the system and there was no extra rewards like what we've been normally getting of paint jobs etc so anyway guys i'm gonna leave it here carry on to Eurobia, and have a look to see if i can find one of those new missions and just wish you all a good day.